Hello, uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Uh, today's date is, oh, it's right below, it's right there, December 2nd of 2023. I, um, I'm, I, I did a, see, I'm not sure if I did a video about it or if I just included something in a video, but... I think I may have not done a complete video on this and Fantasia. I think that's probably wrong. And Fantasia. Um, I think what I did was there was a uh, well a TV show, Space Force or something like that, that I don't know what channel it was on, <coughs> but I watched um, most of. The ep maybe all of them. I think I watched all of the episodes. It was okay. I kind of liked it. But there was just a short little thing in there where a military uh, security officer is talking to, uh, at, you know, at the base of Space Command or whatever. Uh, and he's talking to this young girl who works at a uh, stand out there that uh, sells, you know, hot dogs and popcorn, I don't know, whatever, and he's talking to her. Now, she is the daughter of the general who is in charge of Space Command. But anyway, he's, uh, he is interested in her. I don't think she's really interested in him. None of this matters, but by the way, <laughs> why am I telling? But anyway, he, something is said, and then uh, he says, uh, to her, I, I think maybe she asked him to call something or, well, you know, whatever. And he, he said, oh, I suffer from anphysasia. And he explains to her that he can't pull up images or whatever. And uh, I actually have that. And I made a comment in the, I can't find it now. <laughs> I can't even find the space video or that video I made. On, well, I didn't do a good search, but I can't even find that. But this is a few years ago. And uh, now I knew about that before the, before the video that I saw. I was, uh, let's see. I was... Married for 12 years. Let's see, she was 18, I was 26. We were married for 12 years. And during that time, in some conversation or something rather, I don't know exactly what was said, but um, I'm not sure if we were watching a TV show or a movie or, I, not, I can't remember. But uh, I said something uh, about well, like uh, Elvis Presley or something like that. And she said, oh, I don't need to, I can't remember. No, this is maybe not exactly what was said. I'm just trying to, because it happened a long time ago. Uh, and I said, and she said, well, I don't need to, uh, you know, to watch that movie or do such and such or whatever it would, you know, whatever it is. Uh, she says, because all I have to do is just call it up in my mind. And uh, I can see, you know, Elvis Presley or whatever, or whoever I want to see. And I said, what? And I said, uh, you mean some sort of, and she said, no, no, in exact, you know, exact detail. I can see everything. See him singing, dancing or whatever. I said, what? She said, yeah. And uh, so um, I think I'm, sort of forgot about that. And then, I forget what it was, a few, after I was divorced, a few years later, or something, something came up about it, uh, about this, and something came up, and then I realized, wait a minute, yeah, uh, I have Anphantasia, 
And not only that, there's a de there's degrees. You know what? So some people, well, like me, I can't pull up anything. I can't. I, cl I close my eyes. I can't picture an apple. I can't picture anything. I do not. Now other people have varying degrees of of this. Um, I guess probably I could go to um, Amazon because I bought this book off of Amazon. I could probably go there. Let's let's do that. I could go, probably go there and well, it doesn't matter. It's just that I'm uh, 82 years of age and I'm not sure if this if I discovered this in my 70s or, you know, late in life this popped up. All my life, you know, when somebody said uh, something about, you know, I didn't really think that exists. Okay, so I put a little bit of information about this and a link to this book on that video that I made, which was, I think, talking about the new Space Force, you know, TV show. Uh, but now let me see how I'm going to do this. I don't want to rip off somebody. Um, but let's see, let me go over here. Okay, you're not seeing that. So what do I, wait a minute, what do I have to do here? Um, desktop, okay. Display primary. Okay, I think that's it. So then I can drag this over here. And you can see it. Okay. This uh, young lady. <laughs> um, why is Jim laughing? Okay, this young lady makes excellent TikTok videos. And... Uh, really great and two on subjects that I really like and here she let me um, see if this is the beginning five seconds into it I'm going to play just a short little part of this and then I will um, put a link to her site I suggest that if you're into TikTok be sure and subscribe and uh, Anyway, um, let me play a little bit of this, but I don't want to infringe on a copywriter's. I don't, you know, but anyway. So here we go. Uh, what she's talking about here is this video that I have about driver's ed class and videos that they used to show in driver's ed class to some of us. And a lot of folks over here are saying uh, that it was hard for them to get these images out of their minds. Um, and that, like, to this day, some people still have these images in their minds. What I didn't know for most of my adult life, I actually didn't learn this until just a few years ago, is that I have something called aphantasia. And what that means is that I don't have the ability, I don't visualize images in my mind. Uh, let me tell you what is so weird about this. Different people have the ability to visualize images in their mind to different degrees. There's a spectrum where on one end, there's people like me who have aphantasia. I close my eyes and I try to visualize the black screen. And then on the other end of the spectrum is hyperphantasia. People who are very good at visualizing images, images in their minds such that they can close their eyes and they can see something that looks like a photo or like a movie. And then a lot of people are kind of somewhere in between. Maybe they lean a little more toward aphantasia or a little more toward hyperphantasia or they're somewhere in the middle. So that's just interesting in itself. But let me tell you what really freaks me out about this. Oh, and I'll also tell you kind of how you can do a quick test if you want to figure out sort of where you fall on the spectrum. Okay, but let me tell you what really freaks me out about this. So my entire life when people would say, you know, visualize X, Y, or Z, or close your eyes and picture yourself on a beach, or, oh, you know, I'm, I'm picturing so-and-so or such-and-such, -such, or I can't get this image out of my mind. I always
Okay, let's see if I'm back. <laughs> I forgot to... Uh, I pulled up Manicam, and, which I use, and apparently I uh, need to go in and reset it for... Um, I don't like that. Wait a minute. Let me put the different... Which camera did I use here? Let's go with the... Um, Avery Media. No, that's one I'm using. So let me go with um, oh, camera, not the Avery Media. The um, okay, over here, go down. This one, okay. Let's see if I got the audio working. <laughs> I made a mess of this but I'm not going to start over. My time is valuable. At 82, your time is valuable. Anyway, I'm going to put a link to this video of this uh, young lady who makes great videos on TikTok. And I suggest that you... Um, Oh, I just got, she's showing this. I just got to talk about that. Okay. She talks about it excellently, so please watch her video. And then take the test yourself. You know, give her a thumbs up, or whatever they use over there. And, uh, okay, people have this in varying degrees. And, I well, in your ability to pull something up and, you know, if um, varies with people. And... Um, I can't pull up anything. Zero. Uh, and it sounds like this uh, attractive young lady. Why is Jim smiling like that? See if you can figure it out. Be a detective and see if you can figure it out. Um, anyway, mine is I have the to I have it totally. I can't. I close my eyes. I don't. I can't see anything. By the way, I spent uh, 30 years hospital security, and I was a reserve police officer for I don't know seven or eight or nine years or whatever. I can't remember the exact number of years, but uh, that's not something. That's not something good to have when you can't close your eyes and pull up something from your memory or whatever. Believe me, it's not good. That was a disability. <laughs> um, so, anyway, please uh, check out this young lady. Uh, check out her video and might do the test yourself and let us know. Actually, she's done a panty. You know, uh, click there and leave a message and let her know. And uh, how you, if you, you know, where you fall on the scale of one to five. Uh, so, uh, let's see if I remember how to stop this now. <laughs> I just... Or maybe I need to take a nap or something here. Anyway, please uh, watch this young lady's. Is that a smile, Jim? No, it's not a smile. Anyway, uh, thank you very much for watching. <laughs>